Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video. This is another reaction to the, I guess it's the US high schooler, high schoolers trying British snacks for the first time. And in this one, the snacks look like snacks that I actually really like, which is a good start because before in the videos, not all of them have been foods that I feel like are liked by a lot of people. Sometimes it's like hit or miss foods or whatever. But in this one, based off the thumbnail, the snacks look like snacks that, you know what? A good portion of the population actually love but um we're gonna check this out and see what their reactions to it are they're probably gonna hate them but hopefully going to enjoy from this is some more of my reactions links are in the description to my patreon where you can see more reactions that i can't post to youtube but let's check this out and see their reaction today we have some british snacks for you Ooh. oh okay ones that i like monster much i love these but they're pickled right so not everyone's gonna like them because it's a tangy twiglets they're gonna hate them it's just the same as Marmite. They are made from Marmite. Mr. Kipling's. I don't know about these. People love them here. They're not my favourite. I mean, I can't lie. They're good. They're just sweet cakes, but they're not my favourite. Skips are probably my favourite crisps of all time. They just melt in your mouth. Flying sauces, they're like what kids have. It's just like sugar. You bite into it and it's just sugar. They're quite satisfying, but they're not for everyone, I don't think. I love chocolate orange as well. One of my favourite chocolates, but there's one thing that I love and I'm hoping they love. If you love prawn and cocktail, I'm hoping they love skips, man, because they are the most satisfying crisps on this planet to eat. You just put like one on your tongue and it just melts. I don't think British snacks are that different than American snacks. I don't think so, but we do have specific flavors and brands that you guys probably haven't had before. First up, what we call in England a pack of crisps. Is that chips? Or snack? Yeah, that's chips. These are Monster Munch. Monster Munch. <gasps> the bag feels so cheap. Wait, this is like wannabe Lay's. I've seen this brand before. This wannabe, wait, who was before? Lay's or Walker's? Bob of Lay's. They literally just cropped out the word Lay's and put Walker's on it. <laughs> oh, wow. Get Sorry, I am I am triggered right now. I am. I... Walker's was first, wasn't it? Walker's was before Lay's, I'm pretty sure. I'm triggered. Walker. <laughs> Walker's? Oh, pickled, oh, pickled onion. Ooh. This kid yeah, hates all our food. onion flavor crisps before? No. It's a little ham. I'm excited. Wait, this is it a hand? Yeah, it's, like, it's a hand. <gasps> flavor, right? They're quite sour. I mean, it's pink. <laughs> <laughs> they're, they're good. <laughs> <laughs> you, got, you, got it, you got it, you got it, you got it, you got it. No, that's disgusting. <laughs> What don't you like about it, Andrew? Everything. <laughs> Everything. It's like vinegar. Yeah, that's one of the main food groups in the UK. <laughs> Especially when it comes to Meat, snacks. vegetables, salt, and vinegar. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, the wire didn't even help. Oh. <laughs> yeah, it does not help. Water makes it worse. Mm, no. No, I don't like it. <laughs> no? No. <laughs> yeah. What was that Is pickled not like a flavoring and like crisps and stuff? Because maybe if they're not used to flavor, I can understand. But I would have assumed it is a flavoring and like packets of crisp or chips or whatever. Like whenever I get a cheeseburger at McDonald's, uh -huh. I say no pickles, no onions. Okay. Now that these two are combined. Oh, okay. Okay. It's literally everything you don't I want in your order. Well, I actually like them. I would take this to school every day. Yeah? He likes Next it. up, maybe you need something a bit sweeter. Mr. Kipling's Battenbergs. Mr. Kipling? Mm -hmm. Who is this guy? Who is this guy? <laughs> these are cute. Ooh, they have sugar? These are definitely sweet. Are you ever open them? <laughs> He's so slow. Yeah. They look He's so hungry, majestic. <laughs> it's like a little marshmallow. Oh, that's a lot of sugar. <laughs> Extremely sweet. <laughs> it tastes like Play-Doh. Play-Doh? <laughs> <laughs> Best Play-Doh I've ever had. Yeah. No, this is really good. <laughs> He's like it like bread boards. in the middle. It's cakey. Mm. Cake. Yeah, I'm surprised. He used to hate our foods. Okay, they've actually got some decent stuff now. They, uh, one they're gonna hate is the Twiglets, 100%. They're all gonna hate them. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. oh! I love it. You know oh. when Eli likes it because he takes one bite and then he just puts the rest oh. of it in. <laughs> <laughs> one of the best things I've tried for sure. Okay. Nah. Dang. Oh. You're not a fan, Victor. What? Not like a big fan, but it's good, but just not. You'd rather eat those chips? I'd eat those That's chips. Crazy. Andrew is really triggered by that. I thought there was no such thing as a bad opinion, but. <laughs> <laughs> Next up, we're going back for another pack My of crisps. My favorite, man. Skips. I love How these. How can you guys call them crisps yeah. in the UK? <laughs> you guys call them fries, chips. We do. And then you call chips crisps. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> it makes no sense. Prawn cocktail flavor. 
Do you guys have prawn flavor? cocktail flavor crisps? No. No. I don't even know what Oh, see, if you're used to the flavors, you'd like them, but if you've not got the flavors, they might not like them. These are so satisfying to eat. Yes. <laughs> it's like a shrimp. Oh my god. <laughs> what does it smell like? It grills. It smells like it smells fish. Like, yeah. like fish, yeah. Huh. I like it. Kind of sour. Like really yeah, oh, it's really soft. Cool. Salty. Very it's salty. Mm, I didn't realize it was salty. I like them. Oh, is it good? It's good. Oh, it's not bad. It just smells like really, really, really strong. I wouldn't open this in public though. Yeah, okay, really? People are gonna hate you, yeah. yeah. I don't think I'd go out of my way to buy them, okay. but if like they're offered to me, I'll definitely take them and I'll enjoy them. Okay. All right, next up. Flying sausages. This is such a weird option to have. Are these a typically British thing? I just thought they were at like theme parks. They're like a, they're like a theme park sort of sweet like you have like candy floss and then you have like all that kind of like maybe popcorn and flying sauces they'd be like theme parks and stuff i just assumed they were everywhere but i guess they're not oh wait i think i'm gonna like these do you guys call ufos flying sauces here no we call them ufos okay <laughs> <laughs> these are nostalgia trips for us we had these growing up in party bags they're very classic sweet that you'd have when you're a little kid interesting first thoughts it looks like cardboard. Yeah, like cardboard. It does taste yeah, like, like looking at it, I don't. It tastes like cardboard, but it does kind of like melt in your mouth. I don't know if there's gonna be taste. They look like styrofoam plates. It's not. They look like styrofoam plates. They look like styrofoam plates. <laughs> yeah, I mean they they kind of. They don't smell like anything. They kind of feel like styrofoam plates too. They are quite weird. Oh, we're in the middle. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Very sweet. Yeah. <laughs> this doesn't belong in your mouth. Yeah. <laughs> what is it in the middle? Sherbet. It's like sugary, soury powder. Ah. Oh, wait, hold on. This is good. Right? They're really good. Only the sugar's good. The sugar hits you really hard. It's like a Trojan horse of sugar. If it had no sugar, like when I took What's the whole point? The sugar's the main bit. So by, I thought, oh, this tastes like the, the bread from church. What's that one thing you eat in church? It's like the body of Christ, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> For real, they need to change it to these. <laughs> what, a church? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's like communion with like a hidden kind of yeah. pizzazz. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Jesus with jazz hands. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Next up, we have... They're gonna absolutely hate them. I'm assuming... None of them will like these because these these are like these are marmite, but they're worse than marmite because they are just they're gonna they're, no one's gonna like these one hundred percent. Twiggy twiglets. Twiglets. Oh, pretzels. That's pretzels. No. <laughs> pretzels. Yeah, I know. That's what I was gonna think. They're pretzel sticks. They look like pretzel sticks. I'm guessing that's not what they are. They're gonna hate them. Oh no. It smells like the marmite. Is it? Give it a taste. Give it a taste. I don't mind them, to be fair, but I like my. No, I can live with ours. That's a very quick decision. What the hell? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that's horrible. <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> that is terrible. <laughs> That's a zero out of 10. I can't even be offended by that because they are, like, I don't mind them. They're not foods that you'd go out your way to buy. It's usually around Christmas, but they, they're not nice. They aren't nice. I just eat them because I'm pretty basic with what I like and I don't mind Marmite. I don't even know what to call it. It's like, how can you eat this with a straight face? <laughs> People eat these like, yeah. Like you went to if there was one person who would like him, it would be this guy as well, but I'm assuming he doesn't even like him. The store and bought a bag of this? Uh-huh. Yeah. That's criminal to buy that. I like these. What do you think they taste like? No, it tastes like goldfish if they were really, really, really burnt. Like, you lit it on fire and left it <laughs> And you ate the ashes. That's what I think that's what Wow, it, like. it tastes like ashes. <laughs> but it tastes burnt. Yeah. I don't know. It tastes like if someone were to lick a grill, like the little rat. <laughs> Oh, oh. licking a barbecue grill. I don't know if that was the purpose. Okay. But yeah. That's what we got. <laughs> that was bad. <laughs> Last up, we got something really special for you today. A Terry's. I love these. I mean, chocolate orange. Orange flavored chocolate is probably the best mix of all time. But these are so good, man. I love these. I love these. Chocolate orange. Can't go wrong with chocolate. Orange. 
orange and chocolate. You guys, like, yeah. I love oh. this. <laughs> that just broke my heart even more. And the thing is, you got to, like, smack it to, like, break it apart, because otherwise it's all stuck together. <laughs> oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> oh, wait, you got to peel it, too? You, yeah. are, oh. you open it in a special way, so you hold it on the top over the sticker, and you smash it into the table. Oh, oh. Slam it. Like that? Uh-huh. Wait, Eli. I got you. Hold on. Oh, oh there damn. You go, there you go. There you go. I'm scared. You don't do this with all your chocolate snacks in the in no. America? <laughs> oh, oh, wow. Oh, wait, that's actually that's really cool. Awesome. That's Loki really pretty. All right. That is cool. It's like a little apple. Did you say it's like an apple? apple. Yeah. <laughs> it's an orange. It literally <laughs> says orange on what it. The fuck? I hope they like these. Hmm. That's good. That's good, huh? That's good. Right. No, that's really good. This is definitely better than a real orange. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> what do you make of the chocolate? Is it good chocolate? It's bad. Yeah, it actually is. It's, it's pretty good. I like it's it. enjoyable to eat. That's good. Okay. That's, yeah. that's the highest wow. praise we've gotten today. Gosh. It's actually enjoyable to eat. Yeah, we are soaring to new <laughs> well, heights today. Uh, I'm not hating my life right yeah. now. How does it compare to American chocolate? Oh, no, it still doesn't compare. It doesn't compare? I don't no. think so. Hershey's is like top tier. Hershey's. Are you not a fan? Hershey's <laughs> tastes like sick to me. <laughs> <laughs> that tastes like sick. You were eating those over there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good point. Yeah, he's got a point. Twiglets. Yeah, fair yeah. enough. All right, well, that has been British snacks. If you ever come to the UK, yeah. don't get your hopes up because this is literally the best we have to offer. <laughs> no, it's not the best. <laughs> Did you have a favorite? I'm definitely not a fan of the chips, for sure, but like the sweets, like the candy. Right? The Monster Munch, I forgot about this. The, the mini one. Oh, the mini Batten Bats. Batten Bats. Bats. Yeah. I think this is the best snack. British chocolate is good. Yeah. Nice. Make better food in the UK, okay? Okay. <laughs> Why do you guys you? call them, like, biscuits if they're cookies? Okay. Oh, oh. okay. Like, Maybe that. because we invented the language? <laughs> okay. Oh, they're getting feisty. Oh, yeah. this yeah. I have a question. How do you eat Twiglets? <laughs> <laughs> nah, to be fair, we'll see. Twiglets are definitely bottom tier in terms of snacks here. I don't really know how they're still in, like... Like in um, business because they really aren't a nice taste. Again, I don't mind them, but even for someone who like like me who doesn't mind them, I don't understand how they're still functioning. They're so they they aren't good. <laughs> Ollie being so savage about his British snacks, yeah, he's protective, man. I respect it. Got to fight for your fight for your country in some degree. The first time I've actually seen Ollie being triggered and just straight up insulting. <laughs> Ollie is straight up salty in this video. <laughs> oh man. But yeah, I like this, man. I, like, I find it so fascinating, them trying British snacks. And they had some decent snacks. Again, for me, Skips, Chocolate Orange, Monster Munch I like, but there's different flavour Monster Munch that I probably like more. Um, Mr. Kipling, I don't, I'm not, I don't really eat Mr. Kipling. I don't really eat any of these other than... I don't really eat any of these anymore. Chocolate Orange is probably the one that I used to eat most, or Skips, but I've not had either of them for ages. They're like childhood sort of foods, I guess. These aren't, to be fair. Chocolate Orange aren't, but... I just haven't, I don't really go out my way to buy them, but they are good. But anyway, hopefully you enjoyed this reaction. And yeah, if you want more of this stuff, I'll probably do it anyway. But yeah, until next time, like, subscribe. Peace.